Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. And we have some rain falling for the evening commute. We'll see temperatures falling too, dropping down into the 40s. And the showers should start to taper off, especially as we head toward, oh, say, about 8, 9 o'clock this evening from west to east. And by the time we get to 9, 10 o'clock, the rain should all be east of our area. Clouds will hang on, though, at least through 11 o'clock, 45. And then as we go past midnight, those clouds will begin to break up, should clear out. That'll allow temperatures to dip into the 30s tomorrow morning. And once you're getting down into the mid-30s like that with light winds and clear skies, Guys, the frost potential will be there. Then sunshine and uh, mostly sunny conditions at noon 48 and will be around 54 at 5 p.m. We will get back to at times partly cloudy skies tomorrow. Uh, some of those fair weather clouds building up in the cold air. Uh, weather headlines tonight calling for those showers to end this evening with that patchy frost late tonight. And then we'll see a lot of sunshine Friday. More frost on the way for Friday night and Saturday morning. But after the frosty start Saturday morning, nice fall weather on the way with a lot of sunshine. There is the possibility of a shower again late in the day on Sunday. As far as the frost and freeze potential, Thursday night and Friday, the next two nights will be the problem. Frost likely both nights and a freeze possible even in our western counties as we head toward Friday morning and a little bit more in the way of area wide on Saturday morning. That'll just be a function if we get some clouds moving in late night and if the wind starts to pick up and limits how much that temperature drops. But here's the frost advisory for tonight. That's in effect for the Miami Valley from 2 a.m. until 9 a.m. tomorrow and out west in Indianapolis and uh, Richmond, Indiana, Muncie, Indiana, across most of Indiana. Freeze warning tonight where skies will clear out a little bit earlier and give a better chance for the uh, freezing conditions. Notice the freeze watch southeast Ohio and into West Virginia. That'll be for tomorrow night and the freeze warnings in effect all the way out west into eastern Iowa. So many areas will see their growing season end tonight. Low temperatures could hit freezing around Richmond. Otherwise, looks like mid 30s here in the Miami Valley and uh, low to mid 30s across the north and then high temperatures tomorrow afternoon. Most areas climbing up right around 55 degrees for the afternoon temperatures, maybe some mid to upper 50s west of us. And then Saturday afternoon, we're going to see those high temperatures generally uh, right around 60 degrees. Here's the Goodwill Auto Auction camera. We've had some light rain falling this afternoon. Started uh, this morning up in our northwest counties. It's been spreading slowly east and southeast. And you can see our time lapse there over the past couple of hours showing the rain moving across Miami County and Dark County. Mostly just some light precipitation. Uh, the clearing line, that's back west in Illinois, but that should start to move into our area past midnight. Cold front east of us now, and really the rain with this system mostly behind the front. 51 currently in Dayton. We have a southwest wind at 7, 80 percent the relative humidity, and temperatures already in the 40s at Wapkinetta and Bell Fountain, 48 in Richmond, 50 in Greenville and Troy, and then actually Dayton, Oxford, Springboro, the warmest temperatures at 51. There's the rain moving out around 7, 8 o'clock, clearing our area. At 9 o'clock moving east and then finally the clouds start to break up later tonight and that should set the stage for quite a bit of sunshine tomorrow just that potential for some frost so if you want to keep the plants going you might want to cover those up tonight after the rain comes to an end evening showers clearing overnight low temperature 36 tomorrow a lot of sunshine partly to mostly sunny should be up to 55 44 10 o'clock with 48 at noon and then climbing up into the 50s in the afternoon frost again for Saturday morning low 33 high around 60 again some areas could hit freezing Saturday morning and then we warm it up a little bit more uh, 45 Sunday morning high 62 a slight chance of showers late in the day showers looking pretty likely now on Monday actually a little cooler too. a front may slip through and 57 but the front goes back north and we could be up around 70 again on Thursday.